friends today's reading is going to be about if your birthday is going to be 4th 13th 22nd or 31st then this reading is going to be for you and in this reading you know we are going to check out the prediction for next 5 years what are the hidden secrets yes there are certain hidden secrets certain things that are hidden with that you need to know if you know that your life is definitely going to get better the next thing we are going to look is the messages from the universe so these are the things we are going to dive into in this video now this video is going to be a timeless video whenever you watch this video it's yes it's going to be valid for you and there are going to be certain things that are going to resonate with you there are going to be certain things that are not going to resonate with you the things that resonate you have to keep it the things that do not resonate you have to let it go okay now telling you something about uh, something about myself i am preeti and i am a tarot card reader i have been reading tarot since past 19 plus years and in these 19 years yes i have read tarot for people from all the countries yes all the countries that you can think of i have read people from uh, read for ta uh, read for people from those countries and also i have uh, taught tarot to like thousands and thousands of people and in this video we are going to see something about you okay so i'm just i just introduced uh, myself so that you know that you are in good hands and we already have some cards for you okay so we are going to put these cards aside because yes they are going to hold a special message for you okay and uh, yes um let me put these in your side so that you know we have something already going on okay so yes so in this video we are going to see something about you um okay something about you so th these are the cards you know that we have uh let's see so what are these cards okay so first of all uh, yes first we have this embody card feminine power card insecure block negativity dependence negligence so your feminine energy is blocked so how can you feel that your feminine energy is blocked see whether you are a man or a woman there are going to be feminine qualities inside you yes the uh, and there are going to be masculine qualities inside you and it is a healthy balance of both of these that your life is actually going to stay balanced and when you imbalance either of these yes your life goes out of balance and what is imbalanced in your life it is the feminine quality why your feminine quality is balanced i think because you are using too much of your masculine energy and uh using too much of your of your masculine energy i'm just going to give you the uh yes i'm going to give you the reason the thing is that you are too much into working you are too much of a workaholic yes you want to achieve a lot of things you keep on working whole day you could be even working overtime and you are always worried about achievement you are worried about providing for the family okay yes even if you are a woman and if you have the responsibility of the family on you then you are trying to then you are going to see you are definitely going to try to uh, provide for your family because whether it is a man or a woman you always want that your family has food your family has security your family has enough things to survive on okay so yes so this is the reason why you have blocked your fem feminine energy okay so yes insecure blocked creativity dependence negligence so that is there the next thing is questions so this yes see this is going to be something for the next 5 years so if you if you say that you are going to block your feminine energy for the next 5 years it could be that you are going to work too much on your masculine energy in the next 5 years and it is that you know you could have overly indulged in your feminine energy in the past years okay because of which now you are trying to become something different now you are trying to use your feminine uh, masculine energy because you have already used too much of your feminine energy okay too much of feminine energy too much being spiritual being too much um yeah being too much uh, good about yourself going with the flow that is all uh, something about feminine energy and because you have lived yourself in that phase you know now you are ready for the masculine so that is that is that being said the next card we have is playing mind games there is somebody you know in your life who is going to be playing mind games with you gossip sarcastic cynical not speaking truth having nothing to say so uh yes there are going to be people there is specially going to be somebody in your life 
who is not going to speak their truth or who is who is going to be very uh, yeah they don't have anything uh, important to say they don't have any any truth any valid truth any valuable truth to say which is why they are just going to be liars and they are going to play mind games this is going to be somebody you know who takes pictures a lot i know a lot of picture a lot of people take pictures a lot you know nowadays because um yeah we have we have the camera very easily readily available but yes you know just just uh, if you have uh, this person try to judge them uh yes properly because like you know out of 10 people 6 to 7 people are interested in taking photographs but not everybody who takes photographs are playing mind games okay yes amongst them one person is that who is going to play mind games in your life with you next card we have is repetition card over and over boring complacent scattered repetitive non delivering all work no play Ooh, this actually sounds like you you know it feels that you are going to be somebody who is going to be like all work no play because we already have this you know men usually have this that they work a lot and this card already shows you know like to working too much and so yes that is that repetition over and over so something uh is something in your life you might feel like doing over and over it could be even your work it could be working on your skills it could be working on your abilities okay polishing your abilities it could be that uh, this is the card for making a plan vision opportunity decisions future planning discovery considering every angle okay so uh you know as soon as you see this uh, card as soon as you see this video Uh, what you have to do is you just have to make sure that you try to develop a vision for the future okay i missed out saying something you know something about getting a reading because you know as soon as i start giving a reading here there could be some additional questions that could arise in your mind and you would want to get additional readings from me and if that is the case i am definitely you know very much you know ready to do readings for you uh, the link to my website is shown on the screen you can go ahead on my website check out the different packages you know i have for reading and you can book a reading yes readings are not for free i charge a considerable amount of money for readings but yes yes you know it's really worth it it is going to give you quality readings and yes so that is that okay so yes if you are see uh, rather than you know doing trial and uh, trial and error with your life if you just like if you just want to know like yes something about what in the next 5 years next 10 years next 15 years if you pay and you get a reading you actually have a very clear idea of what to expect what not to expect uh yes where not to focus where to focus so you will have a clear plan you will have a clear idea of what to expect from the next 10 to 15 years and you know you would actually pay and get that rather than you know just expecting nothing you know have nothing to expect and just making using your important years you know time and tide waits for no man time that is once gone does not come back so if next 15 years you spent on you know trial and error whether something works or not whether something is going to happen or not it's fine by me you know it doesn't make any difference but it will make a difference to you if you are wasting your years and years of life okay so that is why i would suggest that if you are really really wanting to make good use of your life just go ahead and get a reading okay so yes this card says making a plan vision opportunity decisions so uh yes this card shows that you have to make plan you have to have vision for what your next 5 years are going to look like what your 10 years are going to look like now this reading as i said you know this is like a prediction for next 5 years but you just not going to rely on this right yes you know this is just like an outline this is just like a 30 minute reading but this is going to give you an idea of what your next 5 years are going to look like but what exactly you want to do in those 5 years you have to start you have to start planning you have to start designing you have to do the future planning you have to develop a vision because yes you know based on what i have said you could actually you know uh, yes plan out something where you are your focus should be totally on work because yes we have 
lot of masculine energy here even here we have a card for work and so you can focus something about your work if you are if you are going to be uh, yeah severely obsessed by your work you you uh, make sure that you are aligning your energy in the right direction you know that your work whatever you're focusing on is actually going to give you like multiplied returns in these five years okay working for five years like you're working overly working yourself overly being a workaholic fine well and fine if that is going to happen try to align your energy in that direction such that after these five years you are going to get ample returns of the work that you are doing okay isn't that the correct way of using this prediction right so yes so this says you have to make sure that you make a good plan uh, make good future planning and this says also in all these years you know now you are watching this video but before this video also whatever work you have done whatever hard work you have done you are going to get its return you know you are never going to uh, yes you know hard work is always going to be paid for in uh, sooner or later okay so status abundance self uh, self sufficient sophistication taking it easy on your own maturation fulfillment freedom okay so this card actually says you are going to become a self-sufficient person yes there is going to be abundance and uh, yes there are going to be rewards of your labor so you are going to face abundance also yes in these five years itself along with all the hard work you are also going to get abundance okay the next we have is clinging codependency there is going to be some sort of codependency now just because i see a lot of masculine energy in you you are actually going to be like independent but there could be somebody who is not that masculine as you and they could become codependent they will become clingy okay or this could be that you are going to become codependent and there is going to be somebody in your life who is going to be very very strongly masculine like yes alpha male okay so enabling unhealthy attachment approval seeking caretaking rescuing okay so there is going to be somebody who is and it could be your partner somebody whom you see as your partner somebody who you see as your future partner okay that and this is the card for recovery it says overcoming sorrow reconciliation letting go healing release forgiveness feeling optimistic hopeful so this is the card for recovery are you suffering from some sort of yes you know any sort of you know uh, emotional pain any physical pain or any mental trauma you know that you are still holding on to and it is not it is just not leaving then this is the time you know that it says this is the card it says that the moment you watch this video you have to start recovering from your overcoming sorrow overwhelming sorrow okay now you now you may say what uh, what is it that you have to do in order to recover okay so uh, letting go healing release forgiveness feeling optimistic hopeful now you know there are certain cases where just letting go feeling hopeful and forgiveness is just not easy you know you are just not able to do this i would suggest that you can you can go ahead and book a hypnosis session you know yes hypnosis session is where i will be hypnotizing you and uh, after hypnotizing you i will be uh, i will be uh, yes programming your subconscious mind in a way that you start thinking in a very forgiving way you start thinking in a very optimistic way okay so yes this is what we do uh, in hypnosis okay so yeah so that is what this prediction for next five years is now let's see what are the hidden secrets okay so we have to see the hidden secrets for your numbers okay we have to see the hidden secrets for your numbers okay uh, hidden secrets for your numbers we need to check Uh, okay at any point you know if you feel that you want to get a reading yes you have some questions you know by all means just go ahead and check out my website book a reading you know because yes you know booking a reading is going to help you um uh, yes save your precious time okay so yes okay so there we go we have these cards okay so we have the three we have three cards for hidden secrets hidden secret is uh, okay so there is it is important it is necessary that you have a spiritual guru okay a spiritual guru is going to prove important uh, for you uh, they are going to prove somebody who is adding value to your life 
now yes just because i i saw that you are going to focus too much on your masculine energy see somewhere or the other you have to make sure that you are balancing your feminine energy okay so which is why you know it's important that you have a spiritual guru spiritual guru is going to give you discipline spiritual is spiritual guru is going to give you direction about what exactly you are going to do you are supposed to do how you are supposed to live your life etc okay so having a spiritual guru is very crucial now yes if you are thinking where can you get a spiritual guru i also you know provide spiritual coaching so you can have like a spiritual coaching you know like a session for an hour or you can have like a yearly session yes i do have subscription basis the stuff because yes see sometimes spiritual coaches coaches are so important it is so important to have a spiritual coach in your life you know they are going to hold on to your spirituality they are going to help you to hold on to your better values and morals okay so that is this is what is a necessary it is a hidden secret that if you have a spiritual guru your next 5 years are going to be better this card is about uh, beginning something new this card is about growing something new okay growing something new it could be in any direction i would suggest try growing your money try growing your money try growing your skills okay now you may say okay how do i grow my skills growing your skills includes that you start learning something about the skills and then you start practicing it okay you learn it you practice it uh, and then you put it into action that is how you know you start growing with your skills okay that is needed the next we have is this card this card is about rising above your yes rising above the people who are trying to pull you down yes there are going to be people who try to pull you down but you are supposed to rise above all of them okay that's one thing the second thing is no matter how much people try to break you down you have to make sure that you just stay uh, stay in your own essence stay in your own element such that no can ha no one can harm you okay now you may say how do i do this this you will be able to do with meditation okay and this is like such a contradictory thing because if if i have told you that you are going to focus too much on your masculine energy then meditation sitting for meditation is actually going to become like a chore it's going to become like a mm, yes difficult thing to do like you know a huge huge task a huge the uh, problem that you know you may find that you cannot just sit for meditation it's such a huge responsibility that you need to sit and meditate but yes you know once you develop that habit it is going to pay off okay so i would like to say don't ignore this start meditating right now if you don't know how to meditate where to meditate there is a free meditation of not just one but there are several free meditations available on my youtube channel this channel the videos where you are watching this video a lot of youtube videos are available just go ahead on my channel and check out the free meditations that are available okay that being said now let's get into the messages from your from universe okay messages from universe are going to be something where yes they are going to they are going to be guiding you in the right direction okay these are the messages that the universe wants to share with you universe wants to okay universe wants to warn you universe wants to yes direct to us okay so yes now let's see yeah we do have a couple of uh, universal messages so first we have is have faith okay have faith and so whatever challenges you are going through whatever hardships you are going through the universe just says you have to have faith just you know make sure that your prayers are manifesting remain positive and follow your guidance okay you have to make sure that you remain positive and keep on manifesting yes not just oh your hard work but even your prayers are manifesting okay so keep on praying the second thing is the universe says dream big you know don't don't think that you know let's let's just keep our dreams in check you know let's just spread our legs only how how long the bed sheet is okay that's a very common phrase in indian uh, yeah you know spread your spread your legs only how much longer the bed sheet is yes that that's like a sensible way people think but this card says you know just just think as much as you know higher as you can and your dreams your prayers your energy is going to manifest your wishes okay that is what that says 
प्ले टाइम डॉल्फिन्स नो द इम्पॉर्टेंस ऑफ प्लेइंग एज जॉय क्रिएट्स मेराकल्स एंड मैनिफेस्टेशन सो जस्ट बिकॉज योर कार्स हैव शोन दैट यू आर गोइंग टू बी टू मच Uh, yes, you are going to be too much uh, workaholic because you are going to focus too much on your masculine energy. It is going to be important that you even balance out, you evenly balance out your masculine energy so that you don't burn out your masculine energy. Okay, so you have to make sure that you that you have play time also. So now you may say, okay, with whom do I play? If you have kids at home, you can play with your kids. If you have kids in your society. you can go and play with uh, with the kids in your society or you can play with your pets okay but make sure that you uh, that you uh, take out some time daily and play with yes play with animals or people or uh, yeah try to uh, try to uh, try to figure out some time and uh, involve in playing and joyful activity okay this card says yes so while i'm watching this video if you had a question then this card says the answer to that is yes your intuition is correct take action accordingly if your intuition has been telling you if your intuition has been guiding you with something since a long time and you know you are wondering whether you should focus on that whether you should believe in that or not this card says yes you should trust your intuition okay now you know just because uh, i am saying this something about this card uh, you may actually have like two to three different things and you may think okay which one of them is right if that is your problem you can you know you can actually go ahead and get a proportional reading private reading with me uh, and you can actually yes how many ever questions you have in your mind you can get clarifications on all of that uh, this card is about empowerment you are more powerful than you realize it's safe for you to be powerful so if you are worried about not being powerful if you if you were worried that if you are powerful people may uh, people may judge you people may try to misuse your power people may try to uh, shut you down because of your power that is not the case now you know you can be powerful and it is safe for you to be powerful This card says notice repeated repetitious signs and your inner guidance this can yield valuable information so if you are getting any numbers uh, any repeated numbers any repeated signs okay your intuition your universe is guiding you through all the synchronicities you know that you see around you so if there are certain repetitive signs that you are getting it is telling you something about you know yes your visions your dreams your wishes and if you while you are thinking about your dreams if you see a certain sign then that sign is about your dream and it is giving you an answer about that dream okay so yeah so that is the video for you i hope that this video has helped you uh yes if after watching this video you feel that you have additional questions you want to get your questions answered then by all means you can connect with me and get a reading okay uh, yes the number is given on the screen but the reading is going to be paid okay uh, once you do pre payment after that the reading will be given so yes if you want to know what are the charges the web my website has all the information about my packages different sort of readings there are basic packages and there are premium packages so both sort of packages are available you can go ahead and check out and based on that you can get the readings okay so yeah so that is it for today's video i hope that this video has helped you if you have liked this video hit the like button try to share this video with all other people i will see you again in my next video do stay subscribed to my channel and let me know in the comments how does this video help you until next time keep following the path of your soul's purpose because you are born for a reason thank you so much for watching bye bye